pressure and force are closely related concepts, but are not the same thing and are often used incorrectly in place of each other. In reality, they both represent different measurements. Here's a quick explanation of the two and their differences. Force is a measure of the strength of a pushing, pulling, or twisting effort exerted on an object. When applied to an object that is free to move, it causes a change in the speed or direction of that object's motion. This is called acceleration. The two are related by the amount of matter that makes up an object, known as its mass. The more mass an object has, the more force is required to cause acceleration. This is why it's hard to throw a bowling ball as fast as a baseball. Examples of force may include a ball coming into contact with a bat, meteor strikes, or magnets accelerating objects through attraction or repulsion. Anytime the direction or velocity of a moving object changes, force is in play. Pressure is a measurement of force divided by the surface area over which that force is applied. A person standing exerts pressure on the floor equal to their mass divided by the surface area of the bottom of their shoes. In this case, the mass or weight of the person is the applied force. The concept of pressure is also commonly found in pneumatic systems. When a compressor delivers air to a pneumatic actuator at a predefined pressure, the amount of force that actuator can apply to an object is equal to the fluid pressure multiplied by the area over which that pressure is acting. As you can see, force and pressure are closely related, but far from the same measurement and not to be confused. For more information on how to calculate force and pressure, take a look at our force and pressure conversion calculators at digikey.com.